Uh, no, I can't believe that. Sometimes actually. it pays off to you know believe somebody's April Fool's joke. It's true. But by the way, aren't you exhausted from all the pranking we did this yes, morning? Yes, I am. I'm sick of it. <laughs> we did a lot. We post them all on Twitter and Facebook. They're everywhere. So April Fool's needs to go away for a year. <laughs> That's fine. Because you got to check least. Them out. I know. I got Adam twice today. That's <laughs> the best part of all of this. Okay, so a few high puffy clouds out there. Cumulus clouds building in 71 degrees. It's warm across the entire state. Notice the winds though. That 25 mile per hour wind, just going to ignore that for now. We'll come back to it a little later. Temperatures across the state. We're already getting into the 80s out across the southeastern plains. So it looks like the warm spot right now is Carlsbad at 82. Carlsbad, you'll get close to 90 by the end of the day today. 60 is up to the north in the northwest metro area. We'll get into the upper 70s later on. Okay, back to the winds. We really just can't deny it. Those strong gusty winds are moving in out across the northwest plateau and they're going to continue to crank out across the northern and southern portions of the state eventually, but really northern New Mexico, you're going to see the brunt of those strong winds today. Red flag warnings posted for the northeastern plains. Those are in effect now, and this pink, this red flag warning will actually extend across the entire northern portion of the state once we head into tomorrow. So your wind cast starting now and going through this afternoon, you'll notice the yellows filling in on the map. Yellow is about 15 to 25 miles per hour on that higher end of this scale. And then watch from tonight into tomorrow. It gets a lot worse for almost everyone here in the land of enchantment and even southern Colorado getting in on those windy conditions. We expect winds to be over 25 miles per hour. Those are your sustained winds and your gusts to be closer to about 40, 45. So, yes, very windy. You got to make sure that patio furniture is tucked in tight to the house because everything will be blown around if you leave it out there. Allergies also starting to climb because of those strong winds we have. Uh, ash and mulberry still up to high juniper at medium. The good news is everything else down to low for today. So the setup is relatively quiet other than those winds. Still a good amount of sunshine. Temperature is very warm for this time of year. Once we head into tomorrow, critical fire danger expected because of the winds and the dry conditions. We have low humidity across the board. We're looking at humidity levels below 20%. And then the sunshine continues and then by Friday cold front moves in. It will cool us down. We're still looking at mild temperatures despite that drop in the numbers in the 60s here in the metro. Breezy conditions for some of us, but less wind heading into the weekend. So southern Colorado looking at mostly sunny conditions today. Breezy, but at least we're warm in those upper 60s to low 70s. Northwest Plateau, a good amount of sunshine. Temperatures in the 70s. Get ready. Those winds only expected to get stronger heading into this afternoon. Southwest breezy and mostly sunny temperatures in the 70s and 80s. Another gorgeous day ahead of you tomorrow with those 80s coming back and the 70s fill in for the rest of the work week. Southeast sunny and breezy temperatures very warm. Like I said, Carlsbad getting close to 90 today. Northeastern plains, a mix of the sun and clouds, windy conditions and comfy temperatures. Northern mountains, we'll watch for a spot shower. I'm not seeing anything on radar, though. That should be concerning. Mostly sunny and breezy. That goes for the eastern mountains as well. Mild, though, in the afternoon, upper 60s to low 70s by the later part of today. And the metro area looking at sunshine, gusty winds. Right now, we're at 25 miles per hour. Those will get worse heading into tonight. And again tomorrow, but the good news is less wind, slightly cooler temperatures for Good Friday. Good looking weekend ahead of us. Those gusts are serious business. I know. Nothing you want to mess around with. But gone by Friday. Yes. You think? Okay. Yeah, a little breeze here and there, but nothing like today. Okay. Thanks, Kristen. Mm -hmm. Zuki.